Hey guys, welcome to the second section of this Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix Let's Play. Um, just a little neglection of this, I suppose you could say. Bad on my part because I've been concentrating on this Scooby Doo Let's Play that I've now finished. I don't know why, I just. I find this game a bit different just to get into, if you know what I mean. And now we had just left off where we had found the Room of Requirement and we're going to teach. Neville how to use the spell Protego, or however you say it. I put the list of DA members on the notice board. We can see who's left to find. We can find them all in the Marauder's map. We've seen this cutscene and just put it in again just for the sake with of them. I've been trying to learn Protego, but I can't seem to get it right. Could you teach it to us? Yes, of course I will, Neville. Amani, have you got the spell book? It can be tricky. Let's see if the book gives any hints. Right. You need to point your wand, then move it like this. Yes. I put those in the right way around. Right. Hold on a sec. The sound might go a bit dead. Okay, Neville. Now I got Let it. Me show you. Just do as I do. Okay. And as the game tells you, it's to up. Protego! Great! This means more, but I'm sure I'll remember it. Show me again, Harry. There you go. I never has learnt to spell. Brilliant. Well done, Neville. I never thought I could do it. Let's look at the DA list and decide who to find next. Uh, too close of you. So, oh, got to copy the pencil. Right, for this next section, I think we're just going to be wasting ship. And we're kind of going to waste time trying to find DA members. There's various numbers of them in all several locations. Some of them you have to um, just touch them and they'll give you the... And they'll just go to the room of requirement. But some of them ask you to do tasks or such. And you'll also unlock the mini side quests for... Uh, I don't know why Dolores Umbridge mentioned his trouble with the Weasley. Oh, that's part of Ginny Weasley's task, so just ignore her. Uh, you unlock the, f the teacher task, so that's Flitwick, uh, McGonagall, and Snape and Sprout. And there's various other things you have to find anyway. Anyway, just exit the room of requirement, I suppose. You'll get a cutscene with Nick anyway. I'm finding all this, all the ghosts at least. Mr. Weasley, have you been up to the common room recently? Your sister Ginny seems to be rather concerned about something. Caparo! Um, I'd go around this way, by the way. And just ignore those people sort of standing there for today. Repair these things with the Caparo. Okay, pass in Serendio. Oh, for fuck's sake. And that is assuming there's any Serendio things here. Excuse me, can I use your shortcut, please? Ah, uh, no. You'll have to talk to me if you want to use the shortcut. You mean, he'll have to talk to me. Neither of you knows what you're talking about. Oh, Christ. Can't I talk to all of you? You could, but it wouldn't do any good. If you could find where <coughs> I am, I could let you in. Pardon me. I have to find you. Right. This is a strange task, but you've got to find the other portrait that looks like that. That door there, um, no idea what its purpose is. It, sounds, it looks like a window that's blocked up or something. It's a pointless door, a window, ledge or something. Reparo! Cash Reparo. This will allow us to complete off the seventh floor at least. Basically, just going to go down all the floors. So, we'll go through here. We'll go to Ginny first, since Nick pointed out her. Oh, 
Myrtle is there as And here's I don't if you're near a, a DA member there'll be a scene showing. And Jenny actually looks a lot more realistic in this game, I could tell you. Umbra just confiscated some of Fred and George's things. Phil thinks they're bottles of love potion. What are Fred and George doing with love potion? It's not love potion, you troll. troll. It's doxy we'll for put the sky snack, snack boxes. boxes. We've, We've got, got to get, get those bottles back, back or, or Fred and George, George will be expelled. expelled. Yes. They're in Umbridge's storeroom. Storeroom. Harry, Harry, can you use, use your invisibility cloak, cloak to get, get the bottles back? back? I'll fetch it from the boys' George dormitory. Hey! Oh, you shut can't. up, Mr. Bitchy Sneaker. Or Seeker, for that matter. So I got to walk across here. Can't seem to pick in the boys' dormitory. Apparently the only dormitory at Hogwarts. Weirdly. Depulsor! Incendio! Basically, cast everything on these spells, I suppose. Oh, here we go, invisibility cloak. I love this thing. Now, remember, you need to be quiet, so no chattering, Ron. Hey, you can't come here in 20 seconds without telling someone else. <laughs> we shouldn't try to cast spells while we're under here. There's not enough room. Someone will see us. This more looks like a real invisibility cloak. And and. Unfortunately, can't use portrait shortcuts, so yeah. Myrtle was pissed off. At least. It's always actually a lot more amusing to walk into someone or try to cast spells. Try to cast a spell and Hermione will do this. We shouldn't cast while we're invisible. I told you. Don't, don't cast spells, but under the cloak. Oh, shut up. Okay, enter the third floor. Now walk into someone at high speed. Oh, that missed. Ow. Hey, quiet. <laughs> I love that one. Uh, what a thing to say on games. Well, as you all know, I had my first driving lesson, like, first time ever in a car, driving one. Was it actually as bad as it seemed? Oh, for crap. Hello? 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 Watch out! Fascinating! Fascinating! Hello? Oh, I love that. And you'll be teleported up to the dormitory, so you, and you'll be able to use, right, you'll only be able to get into Phil, eh, Phil's office. Umbridge's office, you'll only be able to get into her now with the invisibility cloak at the end of term. End of term is when you'll be able to get the things in her office, because there are a few discoverable items in there. We actually get one tiny sneak I bit here. I hope make us clean any more vases. I know, I see one more vase, I'll be sick. Camera hints to the vases. How are we going to get past them? We'll have to find a way to distract them. Something that gets them away from Umbridge's door. Umbridge will go mental. Quick! Reparo! Ow! Oh no! <laughs> Watch out! Who's that? Why did that fall off? Ow! I now feel like miserably. Ow! They'll just stand there, look like in twat bags anyway. Ow. Up here. And here's a bridge in our room. Let's talk to her. Discipline. Shh. Hey. 
didn't sound like, like thieves. Quietly, mate. Quiet. Psst. School requires discipline. discipine. There are some bits of parchment on the ground, but you can't cast spells because, of course, you have the invisibility cloak. Look at all this stuff. It's a wonder there are still things left it's to confiscate. confiscate. How are we going to find a bottle of all this? Appio, Doxy Venom. Yeah, that's, that's what I was going to do. <laughs> <sighs> Let's get out of here. It's annoying when you change camera angles and the controller just seems to fixate in one location. Hey, I'm ignoring you, you peeps. Quiet. Hey, I'm ignoring Hi, you, peeps. Hey, I'm, I'm ignoring, ignoring you, peeps. Okay, those two will be doing something ridiculously stupid. They'll be going like that. For absolutely no reason at all. I have no idea why they're doing that at all. I just ignore them and you'll be teleported to the common room. We did it. And with Fred and George nowhere near here, she can't blame them either. They wouldn't get blamed if they weren't involved in this sort of thing in the first place. Come on, let's get back to the Gryffindor common room. And you'll just be teleported there. By game mechanics, I suppose. Like so. And take it off. I know that cloak always comes in handy. Flesh-eating trees of the world. <laughs> Neville loves his herbology. Oh, indeed. Strangely, they've got to walk here. You know, we can run around the dormitory. Stupid. Great! I'll return them to Fred, Fred and George. George. And tell them to be more careful. It's not that I approve, but I wouldn't want them to be expelled. It's not them being expelled that would be bad. bad. It'd be It'd the howl as Mum said. Yeah. yeah. Right, Ronald Weasley, how dare you, you spell that? I, I, can, I still can't say the things. DA meeting. Are you listening to me? No, we're not, you shit face. Why don't we just do this to this? Wingardium Leviosa. Hey. Move, move this chair somewhere. And then take that. I don't know. Get this straight. I want to talk to you! Yes, we're trying to get to you, moody shit face! And drop that there. And then climb up on it. You took your time? Yes. Listen, I've got a stitch of yours that you lost in here. Now I've managed to lose my stitch in one of the portraits around here. You find my stitch, I'll, I'll give, give you yours. yours. Deal. Deal. Oh, here comes a ridiculous scene. It's easy to find a portrait because it's this one here. Excuse me? E excuse me? Is that your snitch? <laughs> snitch? What snitch? The one by your head. Has that old codger got my snitch? What did you call me? You deaf old duffer. Give me my snitch! You're not having it unless you apologize. What the? How dare you? <laughs> A great seeker can't be denied his snitch. Here's your reward, Harry. Wow. We get a snitch. <laughs> I'm a complete discovery you level four. Can. Why really? I haven't been this insulted since 1843. There are more things to see in the room we found, Harry. I'll piss off. We've got a discovery level four. I just try and catch the snitch by pressing. I've made all over. The Wingardium Leviosa. Just put this over here. Press square when it's near and you'll catch it. Try to turn discovery points. That's the wonderful thing about this castle. It's so full of secrets. Wow. I didn't even know that was there for that matter. So if I keep pressing square until it gets near you. It's hard to catch this blasted thing, but there you go. I'll just let it fly around. There you go down here. I'll tell you, Mr. Why don't you come? No, I don't want to shit this.
There are some doors that are always locked, uh, probably because they don't go anywhere, because there's no sixth floor here. Neither is there a fifth floor. Well, there is, but it's not there. Um. Hi, can I use your shortcut, please? No. Seek the man with faces three. He'll say what to bring to me. What does that mean? Oh, he's a rhyming fag. He's annoying. You gotta go and do everything he says, even though he's a rhyming twat. Kinda of gotta run at this, the thing to make it trigger. And it won't trigger, so hold on. Go down and up, and that'll work. Like so. Just go up here. I'll get around here. Ah, oh, fuck it! I hate it when that happens. Uh, I might make this one ridiculously long part, but there you go. I don't know. Do you know Percival Pratt's password? Spouting riddles again, is he? I'm afraid I don't know. Try asking Professor Basil Fronsack. There we go. Just said that. So now go and find that portrait. Um, I suggest going to the portrait of Basil Fronsack from the Flitwick side, not the staircase side, because you're going to go to somewhere that's near to him anyway. So yeah, that's my right. Oh, for fuck's sake. Just open and go through. Come back here, come back here, come back here. Thank you. Thank you. So we're running all the way down to the second floor. There's somebody at the bottom of the staircase, you can see that it's Hannah Abbott. Hers is an easy one. Everything's just turning into place. So just swing round, I suppose. I'm gonna go this way. Um, if I go the wrong way, I think I have anyway. Oh, so I've just gone in a circle. That's not very helpful. Is there a secret passage here? <laughs> Quiet, boy. Who goes there? Harry Potter. A brave lad. But only those bearing the Hufflepuff colours or the password may enter here. Yeah. Indeed. Hufflepuff? Right. And there's always someone in the Huff... In the... For anything that requires some password or anything, it's usually on the... How are you? Hi. Hi. Can you tell me the password for the portrait of Gifford Abbott? He said I had to help a Hufflepuff student. Well, I heard you help Cedric during the Triwizard Tournament. The password is Dragon's Egg. Yeah. Thanks. Okay. I really want to go to Hogwarts. Uh, go down here, by the way, and just get this password. It, the hi, Harry. Yes, hi, Hannah. And um, the portrait for the, for the dungeons to seven floors is the easiest one because you don't have to do anything for him. Hi, Hannah. What are you doing? I need to think, to remember. Oh, I'm never going to finish my revision. Well, we can help you with one subject. We're having our first Defense Against the Dark Arts meeting. M meeting? At Umbridge's band clubs. She'll see us going there. I'll fail my OWLs. I'll be expelled. We'll all be expelled. It's all right. We're going to use a secret passage to get people to the meeting. Really? Where is it? We'll, uh, tell you later. Come on, Harry. Okay. So you're basically gonna find a portrait. Well, now we'll have to find a secret passage to the seventh floor, or Hannah won't come. Yes. And it's right up here. Just talk to him, he'll give Excuse you the password. Me. Do you know whether there's a secret passage from here to the seventh floor? Yes, of course I do. I am the guardian of that passage. Great. Can you let us in? My password is. <laughs> he just tells you. That's it, you just got the password. You don't even have to do anything for him. He'll just give you the password. Making that the most easy task ever. 
Just say scurrilous scoundrel to the portrait of the astronomer on the seventh floor. You can use the passage to get to the meeting. That way, no one will see you getting there. Thanks. Next speech. Does Justin it finish Fletchley's fit to help subtitles? Me with my so there I'll you go. I'll tell him about the meeting too. If you should just vanish into oblivion. Something you can never figure out is why they still don't make them actually walk opposite vanishing into oblivion. Um, go back to here. And then. Dragon's Egg. I had word that you helped a member of the proud house of Hufflepuff. You are due your reward, Mr. Potter. Shut up. Dragon's Egg. egg. Pass, friend to Hufflepuff. Hufflepuff. <laughs> Go this way. Oh dear. Um. Okay, right. Oh wait, hold on. There is something here. I think. Oh yes, there's another. Incendio! It's these incendio ones you've got to be careful of because sometimes the game glitches and creates a buzzing. I don't know why, but it just does. But go right this way. It's that shepherdess you want to go to next after seeing this professor bastard. Hold on. Here's Flitwick who's changed. Why am I not allowed to cast a spell here? <sighs> oh dear, don't walk through that. Talk to Flitwick. I hope the three of you have completed your research into counter charms for your homework. Remember, your OWL exams may influence your futures for many years to come. Yes, of course, Professor. There's just one more counter charm I need to check before I hand my essay in. Uh, yeah, me too. I know the perfect book. Achievements in Charming. Charming. But it's been How does she know the this? We'll she does it. Has it. The game just tells her that it's there. Oh, shit. I'm not allowed to cast spells here for some strange reason. Hey, talk to this guy. Do you know the password for Oh dear, what a horrible portrait. glitch. Ever inquiring. I'll just skip that. I can't. Uh. Are you sure you don't know the password? Improve your memory. Oh, sh it's not going to be a proper image without some strange reasons, so I'm just going to ignore it. So that's the only cutscene I've skipped so far. Do you know Percival Pratt's password? Me? No, no, no. Now that Google Sump fellow, you know, in that hall near the viaduct, he's a portrait with answers. What are you up to now? Oh, I'm now gonna go all the way to the viaduct entrance. Christ, busy okay. here. Wow, watch out. Now down here, uh, Professor McGon- Oh, uh, Dean Thomas, damn! I'll just activate his one now. Uh, random speech that seemed to be triggered. Is that Professor Bin's homework for History of Magic? Yeah, I've got to list five talking gargoyles. I've looked in Hogwarts of History, but it doesn't say where they are. I can't even remember Bin's talking about gargoyles, is that boy? <laughs> Can I borrow your notes of mining? No! Terrific. Can you let me know when you find them all? <laughs> That'd be cool. <laughs> yeah, okay. We'll need to keep our eyes and ears open. There are gargoyles all over Hogwarts, but only some of them can talk. Okay, it's an annoying task you've got to do here. I think there's a talking gargoyle somewhere near Oh, here's a wrap that I'll put as a separate video later. Are you a talking gargoyle? You normally talk to ones that can't speak. I don't normally talk to gargoyles. Or should imagine many gargoyles are grateful for that. Thanks for talking to us. Let's go. She there's didn't McGonagall. seem very happy. That's one gargoyle found. Cass is said you're there you go. With him on our team, they don't Talk to McGonagall. Weasley, Miss Granger, I have a little task for you. By you, I mean Gryffindor's two, two new prefects. prefects. Yes, Professor? I am standing here in expectation of a group of first year boys arriving, arriving for detention. detention. However, However, by all, by all reports, reports they're, they're hiding, hiding in, in the divination, divination tower instead. instead. Please tell, tell them to come, to come here. here. Immediately. Immediately. Of course, Professor McGonagall. Okay, so you can easily find them in a divination tab. They, we sc <laughs> I 
<laughs> that was a nice one, Hermione. Wingardium Leviosa! Uh, sometimes they'll produce uh, go along here. Incendio. There's another one of those things, strangely right next to Morning Myrtle's bathroom. Oh well. <sighs> this one I don't think talks to us. No, it's the snoring one. Also. No, thank you for sending that thing. Uh, go along this way. Oh, there's another one. It's good to send you anything you can because it's easier. Hi. Reparo. There we go. There's another set. Oh fucking hell, that was a glitch. Rushing straight into the bitch face. There's another one of those chest pieces. Oh, what's this in here? Oh, it's just a random door that goes nowhere. Oh fuck, I hate it when it does that. There's another one. That's a pawn, I believe, yes. Oh my god. That's the first time I've heard that, I can tell you that for a start. Well, we'll also, the dungeon entrance is here, so we'll just go there first. Well, actually... Not all of these things could be... Discovery level 5 completed. There are lots of music. Shut up. And there's usually a mopping bucket around somewhere. Reparo! Wingardium Leviosa! Let's just go down here. This is the dungeons down here. And Snape. Ah, Potter. After your last feeble attempt at prison <laughs> What an insult, I Snape! I expect you to write twelve inches of parchment on the properties of Moonstone. No excuses. But I've already got lots of homework. And Potter, anything <laughs> less than acceptable. And you will what suffer a my to see. displeasure. There are cheat codes, by the way, that, that you can't see the sliver of dungeon entrance, but there are cheat right. codes all around the internet. What a complete git! If we're passing the library, we can check it back. And um, strangely, um, um, what was it? I was going to say. I have no idea what I was going to say. Oh yeah, I remember now. Uh, for some strange reason, the uh, um, the dungeon. No, not the dungeon. The sliver in, in common room entrance is there, but the archie calls it say you've got to go there with your invisibility cloak and sneak up behind, but I don't think that's true. Examine. Huh? A list of students? <laughs> Let's have a look. <laughs> Akio. Just leave that there. This is our Google stump guy. Did you know the password for Percival Pratt's portrait. Well, I, I did. Which is the? I'll just go and talk to Gifford Abbott then. We'll go this way because it takes us to Tim. Climb up here, by the way. And you'll activate this. And 
dear, Snape's classroom. I can't believe Snape's in the order. Of course you can't. 